know, 2000 Buddha fans have got to go there and hopefully, hopefully roars onto a victory, but you know what it is, it's, it's hard to see now. I can't take it at Norwich, I can't stand Norwich, it's that club that just irritates me. Yo guys, what's going on? We're back to another video, another match preview. Borough versus Huddersfield Town tomorrow, Riverside Stadium, live on Sky. Half past 12 kickoff. I can't be there. Apologies. I know you guys are probably thinking, AJ, the last few home games you haven't been to, you've got a season to get, etc. It's just hard to get down at the moment financially. Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. My finances are a little bit low and it is difficult for me to get from Newcastle to Middlesbrough for every single home game. So unfortunately I won't be there tomorrow, but I will be doing a watch along with being on Sky, pretty handy. But I like say obviously I will be doing a live watch along for the game starting at twenty past twelve tomorrow afternoon dinner time. So make sure you're there, make sure you come and check it out and make sure you come and show some support, which you guys always do so massively appreciate. Tough game model though, Huddersfield Town at the Riverside Stadium. They're obviously pushing for second place. We obviously want playoffs. We're so close to it now, it's like two points off. Sheffield United obviously got beat the other day by Reading. Reading did a massive favour. And Bournemouth on Friday, I don't really know. I just thought first half we sat in a little bit, which is fair enough, soaked up some pressure. I did feel like second half we could have maybe set the game a bit more to Bournemouth than what we did. I didn't feel like the cause was any sort of a threat, apart from hitting the crossbar really in the second half. That was the only chance they really had to really hurt us. I felt like if we would have got a bit more attack in the second half, maybe he's brought on Balligan a bit sooner for uh, Connolly. You never know, but listen, you know, a point of second place inside the league, you'll take it every single day of the week, so, you know, I can't complain too much, really. At the start of the week, I actually said to somebody, I'd take four points out of the next two games. I've been a point of bomb for a possible three against Huddersfield Town on Monday. It is a massive game, it really is a huge game tomorrow. They're kind of like season-defining games right now, you know what I mean? Every single game like this, it's, you know, the most important part of the season is right now, we're two points off playoffs, Wilder and all this, the players are on all this. I know there's been a little bit of speculation during the week about Chris Wilder possibly going to Burnley. He was odds on favourite. He said he's not interested in going to Burnley. I just hope it hasn't done anything to the camp. I can't imagine it has done, but I just hope it hasn't caused too much upset or disruption to our sort of plans going to Monday. I really hope it hasn't. But as I say, you know, we are at home. We have got a decent record at home this season as well. Before we got beat by Hull the other week, we were nine games unbeaten at home. So it clearly shows that, you know, fans get behind the team well. And clearly, you know, we're making it a bit more of a fortress than what it was last season, of course, season before. This season, especially in the wild, it's been a bit like a fortress to Riverside, where both teams have come in, they're struggling to beat us at times, struggling to play their game, and that's exactly what all those Borough fans want. So tomorrow's going to be tough, though. Huddersfield Town have flew up this season, to be fair to them. I didn't know how enough they'd go this year, but clearly, they've absolutely smashed it. They're now third side of the league table, four points off second. They'll need a win tomorrow. The fans and all this. Hopefully they bring a decent attendance as well. It isn't too far with us, and Borough always sell it out as well. So hopefully they can do the same inside our way and hopefully sell it out. I don't know how many they bring in. If anybody knows, do put us out the comment section. My prediction tomorrow, as close as it's going to be, we need to get three points. Man. We have to get six. My prediction, I'm going to go with Borough 2, Uddersfield Town 1. It'll be a proper close game tomorrow. Honestly, it will be. That's why I'm just going for a late winner from the Borough. Matty Crooks to score it the tree to score a header and a dying embers of the game and a butter hopefully tomorrow evening go back to the top six. If you are going, let me know what's your score prediction, comment section down below and I will see you guys tomorrow, 20 past 12. Live watch along. Peace out.